Y'all get ready? Yes, you get Y'all ready. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. So for all your tea sipping needs, make sure you guys check out lovelytea.net or amazon.com forward slash shops forward slash lovely tea for all your tea sipping needs. Thank you guys so much for your support and stay tuned for the video. All right, so I wanna talk about the whole Lonzo Ball situation. Now we haven't had a sports story in a while and I haven't talked about the balls in a while. So this is the perfect opportunity to talk about what's going on with them. As we all know, Lonzo Ball is still playing for the Lakers. You know, he's not the best on the team, but he's still, you know, he's still doing his thing, okay? It's gonna be very interesting to see how him and LeBron, you know, how they end up playing together. It's gonna be very interesting to see their dynamic, being that his daddy was talking all that damn shit, okay? But anyway, so now this is why Lonzo Ball is back in the news. As we all know, a few months ago, I had announced to you guys that he had gotten his high school girlfriend, Denise Garcia, pregnant. Now, they've been together forever. And if you guys know, they had their own reality TV show on YouTube because my kids were watching it. And it was a pretty good show. And I had a feeling that Denise was very insecure and that she wasn't too happy of all the attention that Lonzo was getting. You know, she's been there for him before he was really famous, before people really knew who he was, before his father, LeVar Ball you know was out there you know drumming up attention and everything else and she always came off as really really clingy so to me I was not surprised at all when it was announced that she was pregnant and they would be having a baby on the way okay so I figured okay whatever they're young he's out of high school now he did one year in college he's entering the NBA she's graduated high school they'll make their little family work okay so I thought everything was all good and in July she had the baby and then I noticed a month ago on September 1st she was posting like a lot of really cryptic stuff and she was saying things like, oh, I can't wait to write a tell-all book. I can't wait to spill all the tea. You know, she was saying a lot of little things. And she was also saying that her daughter only needs her. So at that time, I kind of felt like, well, dang, what's really going on with them? Because the baby's literally brand new. She was just born in July. You know, what is going on that she's throwing all these subliminal shots, okay? But I didn't do a video. I was like, I'm going to just sit back, okay, sip some tea and see what happens. So now as of yesterday, it got really ugly. And I had posted this on Instagram this morning. Basically, she was doing a live stream with her friend. And somebody said, you know, blink twice if Lonzo's a good father. And I don't know if that was one of her other friends who said that. And it was some type of setup. What I do know is that Denise started just, you know, blinking her fucking ass off. Okay, she was like, her eye was twitching and shit. I'm like, oh, really, bitch? Really? So Lonzo's a bad father, huh? Okay, this is very interesting. Now, the other day, Lonzo did post a video onto his Instagram of him and his daughter, and he's listening to rap music. So I'm going to go ahead and play you guys these Instagram clips. Check this out. I'm going to come back with the rest of my commentary. <laughs> So you guys know that's Zoe's favorite song, Let It Go. And Taylor would know that because she's with her at least twice a week. I'm like some Let people. Let It Go. <laughs> Good night. Happy birthday. Blink and... Honey. Okay, so you guys just saw those clips, right? But now what's even crazier is this. Basically, what's being reported is that she's taking Lonzo Ball to court and now she's demanding 30 grand a month in child support, okay? So Denise definitely secured that bag. I really feel like she definitely got pregnant on purpose. Like in the event he doesn't want to be with her and he ends up leaving her, they'll always have a tie with this child and she can still secure and get that money. And this is why a lot of young guys need to watch out, especially when you're becoming an athlete and you're, you know, and you're getting into sports and you're potentially going to make it into the NBA or NFL. You need to protect yourself because again, your sperm is worth millions, okay? This entire situation is crazy. There's no reason for this young girl to need 30 grand a month, okay? I'm sure her mother raised her just fine on less than three grand a month like most of us are doing. Now, I'm not saying he shouldn't pay any child support because that is his child and he needs to be financially obligated, but it's just to the point now where a lot of these young girls are basically getting pregnant and having children, you know what I'm saying, just for a check. 
You know what I mean? Just to get money, just to secure their finances and things like that. And it's not even about the baby. So it's really sad that she feels like she needs to put out a tell-all book and get them for child support for 30 grand a month. When you know deep down inside that family is extremely close and that man would have no problem taking care of his child regardless. That child would not want for anything. That 30 grand a month is solely for her, not necessarily that child. So it's going to be very interesting to see how this plays out. But I think it's really sad because they went from high school sweethearts. I think they've been dating since like their sophomore year or something like that. They've been together way before the fame and it's really sad that they lost the fame to break them up and come in between their parenting and she's just being really messy on social media whereas before she was super sweet. She was not involved in a bunch of fuckery but now she's starting to come off like a Nina Guzman and all these other baby mothers who've gotten pregnant by celebrities and athletes and you know now they're just trying to be messy. So anyways y'all let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire crazy situation honey. Once again, concerning Lonzo Ball and Denise Garcia, basically blasting him, threatening to blast his family, and now looking for 30 grand a month in child support. So let me know your thoughts. All right, deuces. Hey you guys, it's your girl T and I hope you really enjoyed that video. If you want to know more about my look of the day or if you want a way to contact me concerning advertisement and sponsorship deals, definitely feel free to click my description box. There's plenty of information in there. Please stay tuned for the next video. Talk to y'all later.